Hello, Augies Worldwide. I'm Dave Kassler, amateur radio call sign KE0OG, here with another episode of Ask Dave. This question comes from Wayne, KB0JOS. He says, hello, Dave. I'm a fan of your very helpful YouTube videos and I'm currently working through your extra class exam preparation videos. I recently discovered your video on the A-Static D104. That's this microphone right here. It is a classic. It's sometimes called the uh, lollipop mic. Now, uh, he owns the D104 Silver Eagle with the amplified bass, 9-volt battery, original crystal element, wired from my old Kenwood TS430. I recently acquired a new ICOM 7300. I've spent hours on forums researching the best way to wire the mic for the 7300. I've also studied the wiring diagram in the 7300 manual. Unfortunately, I have encountered much conflicting information. My main difficulty is matching the correct D104 colored wires to the correct pins in the mic connector. Since you have successfully made the required modifications in your D104, can you please share what you did with me so I can do the same? From Wayne. Uh, this connector right here, four pins, is wired for the Yesu FT101B up there the radio in the middle there that's uh an ft101b it's yesu it's got a four pin mic okay so what are the four pins okay one pin is always ground another pin has the mic audio if it's unbalanced and then the other pin is for push to talk we'll switch when you do this now you can find the manual for this version of the D104 online. I have the same version, and it's got the A-Static T-U-G-B stand. There's a little uh, control there to control the preamp. Okay, now the question is, um, which wires go where? Well, in your... Uh, Yesu, the Yesu has an 8-pin, uh, the modern Yesu has an 8-pin mic, and the pinout for that is in the manual. So it so shows you which is push to talk and so on. And you've got the same kind of thing, four uh, essential wires. You've got um, ground, push to talk, and the mic audio. Now, uh, there might be a separate ground for audio ground, okay? And uh, there probably will also, on some radios, you'll have the received audio on the uh, output of the mic. Or in the, in <laughs> it is possible that you can have the receive audio as one of the pins on the uh, mic connector. Uh, which will help with headsets and stuff like that. Not all radios do that. Another thing that is common to be on there is either 12 volts or 9 volts or 5 volts. Now, the battery that's in here is um, 9 volts. So you could run that to there so you don't have to have the battery for the thing to work. Every time you switch this thing on, you're switching several things. You're switching uh, the push to talk on. You're also closing the circuit with that battery, which takes this and amplifies it and converts the impedance to go out. When you let it out, everything is off. So you can leave it forever with that battery in there uh, as long as it's got some charge in it. Otherwise, it can uh, corrode and cause some problems. So... Um, what do I suggest? Well, I'm thinking to myself, how did I do it? Well, I got the Kenwood ma or the uh, Yesu manual out, and I got the manual for the D104 A static microphone, and uh, just matched wires by function rather than by color. Okay, and you can do the same. 
think of it by function, not by color. So you don't have a red going to a green or a purple or a blue or something like that. Just the ground is to ground, the push to talk is push to talk. And if there is a separate audio ground, just connect that across to the same ground uh, that you have for the microphone. Okay? I've done it. It's very easy. You can find all of this online readily. And uh, you probably will not find a page, per se, on how this is done. But I do remember doing a video about it. So you can look up that video. Just do a search on D-104, which is the microphone element right there. Okay, so good luck with your project. Uh, the D-104 is a beautiful mic. And if you're going to go in your... Um, 7300 you will uh, want to take a look at how you can shape your audio in there you have some controls for it not like the Yesu FTDX series okay so there you go enjoy have fun with it Wayne good luck persevere and 73